today I want to talk about a champion tool that we use uh, all the time at Tim Levy and Associates for all of our presentation materials. Uh, it's called Prezi, and I believe it's the next iteration, if you will, in speaker support and information communication after PowerPoint. For me, PowerPoint is very linear, very limited, and Prezi, which is based on the idea of an infinite canvas, seems to be uh, the new and next generation. In addition to being an infinite canvas, which means you can zoom in and out infinitely, also it's connected to social networks, which is wildly helpful. Now, it turns out I'm not the only person who thinks this way. This graphic tells the story. Uh, this shows you that over the course of a couple of years, they got to 26 million registered users uh, who have done uh, more than 500 million Prezi presentations online. And it became particularly famous uh, when it was used in some of the more successful TED Talks. The great other thing about it is, of course, uh, it's uh, free. So uh, you just to use it, as long as you share your presentations, uh, it's uh, free to use uh, and then connected, uh, as I said, by a social network. So let's have a look at some actual examples. And to do that, I'm going to log in and we'll show you a couple of our presentations, which are all available uh, one way or another online. So I do quite a lot of speaking presentations in the course of any one year. Let's have a little look at uh, just one of the mo more recent ones, which is this one here called the Fast Book uh, Handbook. This is a presentation, a workshop I've given a number of times. And what you can see here as I go to full screen is it starts off, um, or cancel, yeah, that's fine, that's fine. Uh, it starts off uh, uh, here at sort of a first screen. And if I just hit the arrow keys, it's going to start to move through immediately. It's zoomed in, as I said, pretty much infinite zoom in and zoom out, in allowing me in this case to start off with an exercise that I take the audience through, uh, then zooming out to a table of contents in this case, rotating, spinning. That's the great thing about this, the amazing sense of movement that you get. But what's really cool about this as well is that it's not just based on uh, a linear sequence of events like PowerPoint. So if I want to just move around with my mouse or if I want to just jump into a particular slide, I can zoom out, zoom around. Hang on, I've got the wrong orientation. Click on that. Oh, hang on, I want to go really close on that. All of these things are possible. So what I really like about uh, working with Prezi is it allows you to establish a sort of a visual paradigm. In this case, the visual paradigm is you know, using a clothes peg uh, in front of a um, uh, in front of a board, and obviously then we've designed screens and gone in and out and screenshots and all sorts of things like that. So most people ask me where do I find these visual paradigms? So I need to flick over to another website that I use for that, which is a graphic website I use really quite a lot called 123RF, and we have a separate video on that if you'd like to find out more. For today, what I'm going to do is just log in so I can get to my account and see if I can have a look at one of my collections uh, that I have here. I have these, they call them like boxes, of Prezi backgrounds that I've sort of hunted down and found over the course of time. And you can see there's lots of different visual paradigms here if you don't want to sort of create one on your own. Occasionally we actually set up photography and do that. So for example, this one over here um, is uh, abstract graph of cubes in interior. Admittedly, a pretty terrific uh, a tricky keyword to have to think of to type into the search box here at 123RF. But when you do, it brings up that one result. And once you've got to that result, down here in the bottom, it starts to show you similar images that have other visual paradigms. So it gives you sort of a, a basis to start from with 123RF. And then if we go back to Blurb, you'll actually see that one of my prezies was based on this. I think this is one on uh, creativity. Uh, okay, looks like I can't. I didn't upload it yet to the Prezi server, so I'll show you that next time. Either way, this is Prezi, fantastic tool, great non-linear presentation and communication tool, uh, and uh, how to get a really strong visual paradigm using 123RF. And by the way, just to be clear, Prezi is free. You can pay some money at the desktop version levels. Uh, over here in 123RF, you can see I've already bought uh, this particular image, but you know, five, six, maybe ten dollars. Uh, to actually buy the image that you need to use for Prezi. So there you go. Prezi, my absolute choice, hands down, when it comes to uh, presentation uh, materials and speaker support.